We are learning more about an educator accused of purposely hurting a special needs student, then conspiring to cover it up. Diane Renee Smith turned herself in to police. She's accused of using push pins to prick a child. And York County investigators say the abuse didn't stop there. Ten of your side's Aaron Kelly joins us now to explain. Aaron? Well, we know that there are several campuses for the Center for Autism, but this is the one we're talking about here at Yorktown Middle School. Now investigators are trying to find out if there are any other victims of abuse. Two instructors from the Center for Autism are on leave and facing charges from a child abuse investigation. York Pocosin Sheriff's deputies say it started with a report from another staff member passed on to Child Protective Services. They say she told investigators she heard screaming and found a teacher assistant chasing a 13-year-old special needs student, sticking him in the arm with a push pin. The witness said the woman used a cleaning wipe on the child's cuts. Diane Renee Smith of Hampton turned herself in and is charged with assault and battery and contributing to the delinquency of a minor. Investigators say the witness said she heard another woman in the room talk about covering up the incident, saying the push pin marks were bug bites. Darcy Badami of Yorktown turned herself in and is charged with contributing to the delinquency of a minor. Joseph Johnson of New Horizons Center for Autism says, We continue to work in full cooperation with the York Pocosin Sheriff's Office and Child Protective Services in this investigation. Student safety and treatment is a priority. And we went by the home that we believe to be is Smith's home, and someone there told us to get off the property. Nobody answered the door at Badami's home. Now, there are court documents that we are expecting to be turned into the courthouse. We checked on that several times today. We're going to keep checking on those to get more information about this case. Live in York County tonight, Aaron Kelly, 10 on your side.